Welcome to the world famous Guaranteed RV Super Centers here in Junction City. Yep, I'm the van guy, Gary Christians, bringing you some more hot products. The Bolt. What a machine. What power. What nice door. Really nice if you're in a campground trying to sh close and open this. It's real quiet, so you're not banging and clanging for your neighbors. Uh, this right here is a little workstation. It's, it can be moved up and down or removed. This, of course, folds flat. So when the passenger seat is turned all the way around, you've got a nice workstation. Or you can bring it all the way out here if you wanted to. Uh, I'll point out right here. So this is your power seat control. A lot of controls on this unit, stuff that we haven't had on the Mercedes chassis. And yes, this is a 2019 chassis on a 2020 conversion. Power, I said earlier. Well, we just had our big show at the Lane County Fairgrounds. And one of the factory reps was there. He said he had a buddy of his take one of these bad boys down to the desert, ran his air conditioner for 13 hours straight off the battery. So most times you're not gonna have that issue, but it's good to know that you can run a roof air in 110 degrees for 13 hours. Pretty impressive. Like I said, a lot of power. We're gonna scoosh back here. Um, It's got nice little, you know, you get ready to go to bed, you've got glasses and stuff. Where are you gonna put them? Well, they got the spot now. Got one on each side. They just rotate back up out of the way. You got some speakers back here, two lights. Uh, these trays slide back and forth as well for both sides. And while I'm sitting down, if you take a look at the storage underneath, I'm just gonna lift this up for a second. See the big storage down there? These do come together, make into a big bed. Uh, this slides over, just this one slides over, and there's that flops down. And then if I remember right, there's two storage areas right in here. Did you see that? You have some access right down here as well for storage. Um, you got your uh, night shades and your day shades, windows pop open, uh, double paned, uh, USB 12 volt outlets on both sides, uh, more USB 12 volts, 110 on the end of the kitchen countertop, and nice big storage area in here, uh, adjustable shelves, but look at the room here. Look how, look how deep that is. You can store a lot of stuff in there. Of course, TV, sound bar, uh, solid surface countertop, single lever faucet. Let me tell you, that is solid surface. It's heavy. Uh, yeah, this slides back and forth, and again, the windows pop open. Um, got a pretty positive latch with it not locked so take a peek in here you do have a, a vent a window that opens up for ventilation with your screens uh, pump switches toilet shower and then this little doohickey right here if you come in with a wet jacket you can hang it right in here in the shower Um, your Truma system, uh, solar panel, uh, battery level, tank levels, water pump switch, heating, heating pa uh, pads for the heaters outside. Um, this is going to go down to like zero degrees. It's extremely well insulated. It's double insulated. It's a true 
four season van. Um, microwaves down below, induction cooktop, compressor refrigerator, and it's under the counter. It's not a big one. You got a little tray here for your scrub brushes. Uh, so it's got the real big screen. Uh, basically, I guess the key isn't close enough. I thought I had another key right in here. It, it's a, a, a key fob. You just push on the brake and hit the button and start it up. Nice big display screen. Um, this side of the steering wheel runs this. This side of the steering wheel runs the dash. This has many levels. You can go through a bunch of screens. You can find out all the information. It's right here. Uh, your screen up front, you can talk to it. If you want to switch channels, get, get its attention and just tell it, tell it what you want to do and it'll do it. Uh, it's totally amazing. Um, four wheel drive. It's got high and low uh, range right here on, on the dash. For all practical purposes, you're going to stop. You could probably go a mile or two an hour to go into four wheel. Four wheel low, you have to stop, put it in neutral, and then make the adjustment. Um, automatic headlights, automatic windshield wipers. Uh, it's got all the safety, distraught cruise control. It's a phenomenal machine. If you're going over the line, it'll bring you back in your lane. It's a very safe unit. It'll actually put the brakes on if you're going to rear end somebody. It's an active system. The other ones just let you know you're going to crash. This one will stop it. Um, let's buzz around outside. Oh, one other thing. This folds out into a single bed. See this hinge here? It just folds over here and makes it into a single bed. Again, the, the lithium system has a gauge up here. It's like a fuel gauge. You can look all the way it is, it's full, and as it goes down, it gets lower. Electric awning, it's got a wind sensor. Outside controls if you want to run your TV with cable and 12 volts and 110. It's got the ladder and uh, roof storage system, so you can choose what you want to do with it. Propane hookup over here in the back. Receiver hitch, wiring, uh, 5,000 pounds towing capacity. These have sensors all the way around the vehicle, so when you're in backup mode, you've got like three different views from really tight out a little bit and farther, and it's got sensors, so if you're backing up, it'll, it'll go red to tell you that you're getting really close. What I wanted to show you, there's another little uh, storage area right here, similar to that one up there, that's accessible from the back. Um, outdoor showers right here, uh, water pump switch. So the side screen I didn't talk about because I'm gonna talk about the, the rear one. So if you roll the screen down in place, that's how it closes up. It's got a Velcro tab to secure it if you don't want it to open back up. Uh, they work both the same. They're very easy to operate and to come and go from the unit. Again, you can throw this tab and it won't come uh, back open. This is an emergency exit. You can't open this from the back to exit out. Power cord. Alcoas. This is your uh, dump station and being four wheel drive, a little higher off the ground, it's a little easier to get to. Um, spare tires down below, city tank fill, black water flush, and your Truma system. It's got little LED lights here too. Running boards are nice and high so you can go out four wheel and, and not take a risk of taking one off. There must be a question or two. I'm available by emails right there. 
but why don't we just keep it easy? You can text or call me at 541-554-9581. Appreciate your time and look forward to having you go out traveling in your van. Good day.